it's a little bit blurry, but um, but again, um, there's a, a big sort of sign right here. This is either probably at a camp, this is a, a light post even, or it's, or it's um, maybe some kind of a, a park of some kind. But just ponds are really made for human enjoyment for the most part and human use. But if they're managed pro properly, they can be managed for really great ecological value for the long term. So what in the heck did I put this picture in here for? This is actually from a website that this fellow runs. And I'm going to research him more. But as I was putting this together, I was studying some. These are stock tanks or, or possibly even just kids swimming pools. The more I look at them, I actually think they're kids swimming pools. It's probably about six to seven feet in diameter, very small. And this fella doesn't have access to a, a, a live pond, and yet he wants to do research about ponds. And so he kind of created his own little series of, of ponds. If this is about the size I think it is, it's about a 300-gallon pond. This one's 300 gallons, so there's, there's uh, seven of them we see in the picture. There's probably eight right over here. And so he's got eight times 300 or 2,400 gallons of water. If, if it was all in one area, 2,400 gallons of water is about a 16-foot diameter pond that is 36 inches deep, three, three feet to four feet, in between 36 and 40 inches deep. And this is, this is truly ponds. They're small, but they are ponds. And he set them out outdoors because he wanted to simulate what a natural pond would be like. He didn't have an excavator to dig a hole, or maybe even if he dug the hole.